What's up, everybody? This is Eric the Tech Preacher. So it's time to do the battle of the cameras in low light between the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra and the LG V60. Now, I've already done a dedicated daytime video for what both of these cameras, but this video right here is all in low light. So on this YouTube channel, I do two dedicated videos with devices. I do a dedicated daytime video and a, ded a dedicated nighttime video. So in this video right here, this is the all low light video between the LG V60 and the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. And you know what? It's time to wipe the camera lens. And the reason why I wipe the camera lens on camera, because there's no excuses. There's no excuses on this YouTube channel. Let's go on to see which one is King Supreme. So sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. All right, guys, so here it is. Galaxy Note 20 Ultra versus the LG V60. Doing this all in low light. So today, guys, I'm in a park, kind of late at night, and I want to show y'all guys this as I'm in a park. I mean, we have some really low light conditions at this park here, so I want to kind of show off the cameras. Now, look at the lens flare coming off the light over there. Which one give you the best rep representation of how good or how bad the cameras are in low light? And I'm going to go audio from side to side so y'all guys can hear the audio with both devices. But let's go on the walk. Both devices got optical image stabilization, uh, but uh, at night things change. I always got this myth. If you want to know how good a camera is, you got to shoot in low light. Now, look at the ground there. You got two shades of color here. So the white balance is different on both devices. And from my point of view, I can tell you that the V60 give you that natural look versus the Galaxy Note kind of give you that yellow tint. I don't know, I'm looking at the viewfinder. You be the judge for yourself. But looking at it, you be the judge for yourself. And I'm taking a lot of photos here at the park. And uh, I'm going to another place to shoot some more photos. But uh, I want y'all guys to see this. All right. So this is the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra and the LG V60, baby. All right, so this is the front-facing camera of the LG V60, the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. I want y'all guys to see this. Now, I can tell you, looking at the front-facing camera, I have the light shining, shining on me right now, and looking at the viewfinder, the Galaxy Note has me a, uh, I don't know a color that I can say it's more of a pale looking color. I know the white balance is totally off on the Galaxy Note. Looking at the viewfinder, I don't know, maybe it will change once I get to the final production. But uh, looking at the LG V60, it looked a little natural there, but uh, you beat it just for yourself. And I'm noticing that uh, with the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra, it seemed to oversaturate a lot 
and uh, sometimes you get that oversaturation and this is one of the reasons why you might be getting this yellow tint or oversaturation because I'm at night and the camera might be kind of conversating for trying to make it look good but it's giving me a more oversaturated look I don't know you be the judge for yourself but look at the greenery behind me now in this shot <laughs> Look like the LG V60 is a little oversaturated. I don't know. <laughs> but I can tell you right now, shooting at low light, it tricks the cameras here and it makes the devices just go haywire. I mean, shooting at low light, the, the devices is trying to compensate, trying to do white balance, change it, all kinds of stuff. And sometimes things look the way it looks. This is all low light. So this is why I like to test these cameras. I'm gonna go audio from side to side so you can be the judge for yourself. This is Eric, the tech preacher. Wow, look at that. So, uh, <laughs> so I want to see, let y'all guys see how the color representation is. And again, I'm looking at the viewfinder and I'm looking really yellow like, uh, <laughs> and I, it don't look that good on the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. I don't know, but you read it just for yourself. This is Eric Tech Preacher from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about all these devices. Well, both of these devices in action. And this is late at night, so let me get out of here. See you guys on the next video. Whoo, peace. Let's go.